Hey, so today we're going to talk about the most insanely difficult riff I know. And this one is difficult because it just, it starts off simple, but it keeps on building and building and adding layers, and it comes in three levels of difficulty. So we're going to start with level one, which is fairly simple. So what if we had a nice rhythm part that went like this? And if we added a nice simple melody on top of that? That would give us level one. So, if we wanted to make things a little bit more difficult, what about if we kept our simple rhythm, but added a complex melody on top? What about this melody? Sounds difficult, right? Well, let's try it out. And there we have level two. Pretty difficult just to even to play that. Um, some of you might have recognized by this point that the song I'm playing is Day Tripper by the Beatles. And some of you might even realize that the version I'm playing is the Tommy Emmanuel version. He's this incredible acoustic guitar player. Well worth typing on YouTube straight after this video, go and look up Tommy Emmanuel and be prepared to be blown away. So this is his version of this song. I first saw Tommy when I was about 16 and I was with my parents. And this was the part that really blew my mind when he went to level three. And it was at this point, I went with my parents and my dad turned to me at this point and went, why the hell is he doing that? So, what did he do? Well, how about if we retained our complex melody from the last time, but this time instead of playing a simple rhythm, we added another complex melody, or the vocal line of Day Tripper, which goes like this. And we played that simultaneously with Seems impossible, right? Well, let's try it out. So there you have it, the most insanely difficult riff I know. Uh, playing two complex melodies simultaneously. So if you liked this riff, and you want to hear more, or you want a lesson on this riff, then let me know in the comments. Also let me know what the hardest riff you know is, or what you think the hardest riff ever might be. Maybe that could be a future video. Well, I hope you enjoyed this one, and I'll see you next time.